senior night is ready to go. I'm not allowed on the field for this, but no need to worry. I am still gonna be able to film it all. Of course, that's the tunnel that the football team typically uses, but tonight will be in use for the senior soccer players. The parents are right there. And we're gonna toss the camera around here for a quick moment. Tommy Maroon here, of course. Students are here today, but not really a student section right now. I think that'll change soon. SOL. <laughs> Someone's taking a picture of me. Oh, well, I'm sorry about that. I was going right in the middle of broadcasting this game, which is going to be a good one. Of course, last night, the boys varsity team played Roosevelt at Roosevelt lost. This is a team that hasn't lost so far on the campaign, going 4-0-2. and As the music is stopped, we are just patiently waiting for the... Oh, Oh guys, sorry. Patiently waiting for the senior to be revealed. Oh, the tunnel is where they'll go and out there to the field where Coach Holland is. Team talking about things. We won five to nothing and what do you call it? Junior varsity soccer. There's a tunnel for you, folks. I think it's time to go. There are four seniors that will be represented tonight. There they all are, their parents at least. It will be just about time to get this show on the road. The four seniors somewhere over there. As accustomed, seniors will probably be starting on this senior night. H. Austin Media has come to this great game and I'll blame them. I mean, for these seniors, it's their last ride here. Right now it's been a, oh my goodness. It's been a good ride so far in this season. All right, we're 4-0 and two, which is admittingly not shabby. In fact, that is basically great. Hello, excuse me. Four seniors, oh, three of them right there. All right, no, those aren't the four seniors. Four seniors are gonna Make it over. Gonna get honored out here tonight. We have Pey Peyton, Peyton, and Maria are the four seniors. There's Lee and Peyton, Maria and Peyton over there. Peyton Cook and Peyton Hoagland. There are your four seniors. And it's showtime. Here we go. They'll be introduced right now. And here they go, heading out of the tunnel. Twelve and a half minutes towards opening kickoff. They're saying they're ready. Okay, our first senior is Peyton Cook, number 26. Peyton is escorted by her parents, Heather and Jerry Cook. Peyton is committed to play soccer at the University of Cincinnati. Her personal study is planned on new business. Her favorite team members are the dance parties before going to Philadelphia. 
for advice at the end of class, don't, don't watch Charlie Gossel. Katie would like to thank, thank her mom and dad, dad for always supporting her in everything she does, does and her coaches, coaches for helping her pursue her dreams. dreams. Coach, coach Rick Kiribati, her club coach David Kozlowski, and her college coach Neil Stafford. Number 26, Katie Cook. Our next senior is number 12, Maria Davis. Maria is being escorted by her parents, Sal and Tina Davis. She is currently undecided at what where she'll be attending college. Her favorite team member was playing on the JV team of freshman year and having an undefeated season as a coach player. Her advice to the classroom, try not to stress too much and instead focus on the experience of playing the high school sport as well as enjoying the way you love the years. She'd like to thank her parents for supporting her for the classic career in every way, including one star rides, hotel stays, coming to games, and many other sacrifices everywhere where she needs to be. Number 12, Maria Davis. Our next senior is one of our captains, number 11, Leah Heine. Leah is escorted by her parents, Laura and Christopher. She's currently undecided what college she'll attend, but she'd like to study, study cybersecurity. Her favorite team memory is winning the Suburban League last year for the first time in girls' soccer history. Her advice to the underclassmen, never give up. She'd like to thank Coach Rick for coaching since she was young and for pushing her to be better. And she wants to thank her family for supporting her and her parents for taking her to the early morning games and late night practices. Number one, Captain Lee Hines. Our final senior tonight is number 15, Peyton Hoagland. Peyton is escorted by her, her mother, Brittany, and her father, Tom. She has undecided what college she will attend, but she'd like to study biomedical science. Her favorite team memory is getting ice cream after the final playoff game versus Amherst. Her advice to the underclassmen, enjoy the beauty of the simple moments. She'd like to thank Coach Howell and Coach Lloyd for pushing her to reach her true potential, and her family and friends for supporting her and cheering her on through the years. Number 15, Peyton Hoagland. Those are all the seniors. Three of them undecided on where they have. Uh, we have one more senior, Lily Lekovic. She could not be here tonight, but we wanted to recognize her also. We'll try to recognize her later in the season. Lily Lekovic. Maybe she'll show up later on this year. Hopefully she does. Three undecided. They might go BW in the words of Dumb and Dumber. So you're saying there's a chance. <laughs> Uh, national Anthem, all that stuff coming up when we get back. 